Until we noticed that you were yeah, still Yeah, it was just one laughing. second. <laughs> yeah. oh, okay. We chuckled and then... Okay, so he's coming back laughing. Okay. Powers of B trying to keep us down. No one can do it. They no won't one can, stop us. They can't stop us. They won't stop us. We won't be can't silenced. Stop, won't stop. Run button forever. They can't make it be. They we will not be. We won't shut up. That's right. We won't run button. We won't run. We won't shut up. You keep asking. We keep. You keep saying please don't. Please stop. We're no. No. Keith, wake up. You have to be at work in a couple hours. I'm, I'm awake. I already called my work. So, are we going to go on? Um, 26 hours since you're not going to work? Yeah, I'm just like, right now, I was just like, man, I'll have to do two more hours of this. Oh, I gotta get that Skype. Or do we need that Skype? Um, it's up to you. We've had Skype for hours. Unless we got some new people that can be that Skype, but I don't know. I have no idea. Um, let's just do, let's just hang out and chill out. Do virtual hang high out, hang, hang chill. Hang chill. Max, relax. Got this blanket. <sighs> I'm a little confused as to why. It looks good on the TV, but kind of looks like some garbage on the stream, but hey, what are you going to do? Yep. You're right. This looks great. <laughs> this is barely compressed at all. It looks worse on the stream is all. It's fine. Look at that scary cat. Oh my god, it's so scary. Uh. Oh no! What is this? Did we watch this? Yeah. Okay. Yes, we did. That was oh, great. Oh no! I'm in a glass ball. Someone help me from my glass ball. Three fairies. Will the fairies help me from my glass oh, ball? Fairies. Oh man! Like how the virtual is revealed. Like Hyde lied. Virtual. What? It's virtual? This isn't a regular hide light? What does hide light mean? Probably nothing. I don't know. There are other hide light games, right? There's just one that was on the NES, as far as I know. Okay. Hey, stream, how you doing? That's a little bit better. Yeah? Alright, we're good. Let's do this. So last time we played on the last marathon, we played a bunch of virtual highlight. Yeah. We got, I mean, I don't know how long the game is, but it felt like we made some good progress. It did. Um, what happened was we went to play it again the next day, and our progress was gone, and I found out that the... Claw, the battery in here. There's built-in storage in the Saturn, but the battery had died, and it had just kept that, like, even without the battery alive, it can keep a save for, like, a few hours, and... But in between being powered on, and that was how we kept it alive during the marathon. But then after it died, but since then I replaced the battery, so it's new be, bats should be G two G. Mm-hmm. 
and uh, how are we gonna seed this? Create, create randomly or create with code? code. What are we doing? F uh, eight, five. What? Eight. Not, not some of this. You wanna do like that it was, symbol? Like it was meant to be, like God intended. And then butts. Butts. <laughs> yeah, sure. Keep it classy is what I say. Mm-hmm. Oh, you can only have three letters? No, it's, I'm just, oh. I messed up. Butts. Butts, butts, butts. You wanna just do that? Mm-hmm. Okay. I think that's perfect. I think it's perfect also. I think we're gonna, I'm gonna think we're gonna get a perfect world. Yeah. It's not a... Uh, well, it's gotta generate our, our universe. Maybe, I think it does that now. Our whole universe. Whole universe. So that thing happened where I eat something and then I feel like I'm gonna die. Oh, really? Yeah. It's like every time I eat you. Like... Gallbladder type things? No, like... I feel really sluggish and oh. like I can't breathe. Is there like a, have you developed a trick to make it so that you can breathe? No. Change position a lot. Uh, what's your, what's your website for shirts? People are asking. Shirts.runbutton.com. Shirts. Net. Net. It's dot com. <laughs> no, it's not actually. Shirts. It's dot net. Shirts.runbutton.net. Or shirts.contentburger.biz. If you're nasty. You need um, to stop that. So, Fake Brad wants to know, did both Kyle and Keith st stay awake the whole time? And yeah. Keith actually fell asleep for a quick moment. Yeah. Well, it depends on what you describe as the whole time. Yeah. Kyle has... We never... None of us ever intentionally took a nap, but, yeah. like, I fell asleep while playing a game for, twice. like, a moment, like, a dozen times. Like, oh, more than twice? Like, all the time. Yeah. Constantly. And while we were, uh, while we were not on, <laughs> I was lying here like this. And they said that I was asleep, but I heard them laugh at me snoring. So I think maybe I just made a noise. Yeah, you were snoring. And yeah, your we head was completely back. You your up. eyes were closed. Well, that and you was were on snoring. purpose. I was doing that to rest. Um, my contention is that I was not fully asleep. This is a silly contention, I feel. So th this is virtual hide lied, uh, FMV based, uh, randomly generated. Open world RPG for the Sega Saturn, an all-time classic. Really good, really good run. Great run. And you play as a man, uh, a man trapped in a fantasy world in his pajamas. Uh, he was just asleep in bed, <laughs> well, and then all on. of a sudden he we has don't to know save these a are his pajamas. Somebody's pajamas. He's trapped in somebody's pajamas. And that is a horrible fate. Mm. Without the comfort of even your own jammies. Yeah. You can kind of catch glimpses of his face. Yep. Man, look at that face. What a face it is. That's it. It's an alright face. What's this blue line pointing to on my, my compass? An objective? Oh, it might be my... Starting location. So this is like Minecraft? It's just like Minecraft. <laughs> Bloggy textures, crafting, slimes. Yep, you know. Got it. it all. Voxels. This is voxels. Uh huh. Volumetric pixels. Mm hmm. These pixels got volume. Garnier Fructis, much, volumizing much, pixels. Much like your hair, it's got volume and a messy look. Mm -hmm. It's roguish. Up over here. Ah, I'm getting the buttons all wrong. That's what people should say when they call us by the wrong name. Getting the buttons wrong. I'm getting those buttons wrong. Say, hey, put down the Saturn controller. You're getting all those buttons wrong. 
Six face buttons, just too many. Too confusing. Mm hmm I see some people saying that, like, they want new, like, ne oh, next time we get new consoles, more buttons, so we can have more stuff to do in a game. What? No more buttons. What? How about one more button? No. What if you added a fifth center button? Like, in between A, B, X, and Y. No. Yep. No. What if we added... What if each button was a capacitive button, and depending on your mood, the button did a different thing? And that replaced the A button. That sounds actually pretty compelling. That's basically the PS... You're basically describing the PS4 controller. What did I do? Oh, that took a while. Color bars. That's funny. Controls. Oh, there we go. Oh, I have an attack too. What's my Z button? Oh. Never mind. What is your Z button? What's on Z? What's mapped oh, to Z? I have like light. It's just the like pause menu. Yeah. So last time we were in like a fucking castle. We, we were to, like, wrecking mansion. shit. We went to a mansion. We went to like an underground sewer system and fought a vampire. Yeah, it was great. Or no, we fought the vampire in the mansion. We got. We gotta get vampire back there. Mansion. We gotta. Oh, what's in there? What's over we there? There's a structure. About shit, my vampire dad says. <laughs> Wait, no, go to the right. There's a thing over to the right. More to the right. How did you miss that? What? Go over the... Yeah, there's a fucking... You're right next to a building. I don't need this building. But there's stuff in there. How do you know? I saw stuff in there. What do you mean? I saw things. What things? Uh, sometimes it gets me a little bit of a headache. Cause... Oh, this is like a warp thing. It'll warp me, but I don't want to warp. Oh, why do I... Why am I still moving? Oh my god, so sensitive. Jeez. You wouldn't like to warp? Hydlide is a sensitive man. I assume his name is Hydlide, just like a the yeah. Simpsons game Virtual Bart. His name's M. Hydlide, and the, he just he doesn't give out his first name. Um, hi, so Hydlide... Why, don't, why doesn't he want to warp? Because I know where I want to go. I want to go to that flashy X. Okay. So that's where I'm headed. Okay, I didn't... I didn't realize we had a geographical objective. I thought it was like, I don't know, do the fuck whatever you want. This is virtual highlight. No. We're not here to hold your hand, we're here to hold your... Dick. Dick. Yeah. Listen, we're 20 hours into a marathon. Yeah, that's what we got. Yeah. This is what you're getting. Oh, get away from me, tree. This is what you get now. Are you fucking happy? That this is what you did to us? This is what you get now. Are you happy? Are you happy? Run button. Ha hashtag run button. Do you are you do you like what you've done? Does it make you happy to see what you've done to us? Bunch of fucking that run. This music goes on. It does. Ugh. Sometimes I find the absurdly low frame rate of this game to be like charming, and sometimes it gives me like motion sickness. Right now, it's a little bit maddening. I, and I think that once we get into an inside place, that will be good. Maybe. Once we get inside, that's what I want to do. Oh, right, of course. We gotta go to the graveyard first. Of course. <sighs> Always gotta go to the graveyard first. Yeah. 
It, yeah, it's the game. The map is randomized, but you still always go to the same location in the same order. This is making me kind of motion sick. That's never happened from a game before. If I remember correctly, we can get the treasure and get out, but if we hang around and like fight a bunch of guys, we can get some sweet treasures or something. Get like a long sword. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe like a cullis. I love the dainty stab. Me. Nah. Nah. Eh. Me. He's really just Me. punching you and happens to have a knife in his hands, is what's up. Wait. <laughs> Crucifix from the gravestone. I like Krabby. Let's, uh, let's check the rest of these. There you go. Okay. I mean, I don't know what gold is for, but it sounds important. Got a scroll, that's gotta be something. Yeah, probably like, maybe like a magic scroll, like some sort of tome. An incantation may have. You don't want to mess with Hyde Light. No. Hyde Light will punch your back with a knife in his hands. He doesn't even don't give a fuck. He doesn't even care that there's a knife in your ha in his hands. He'll just do it. Oh, oh man, he looked he's, he looked like he splattered. Yes. But he just got hit. Got you. You got got. Did you get the the treasure? Or are you still looking for it? No, I, I got feel like the. the games I... are five dollars on Steam right now. Apparently. Which ones are? What? Uh, someone just tweeted that all the Lego games are around five dollars on Steam right now. Pretty good deal. I... <sighs> Come on, L button, get with the program. Oh, 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 oh. This looks nice. Are you are you looking at it? Or you yes, I'm looking. Either the chat is broken or no one's chatting like at all. The chat broke for me a couple times where it was not refreshing. It's probably just me. Ten. Yeah, I don't have any things. I'm nice. refreshing. That's refreshed. It'll take a couple minutes to. Whoa, that guy's got mad health. Oh no, that's my health. Never oh mind. yeah, someone said chat's been broken for a while. Yeah. Uh, is chat gone from the... Yeah, from it looks the... like it's working. It looks like it's working, We're... so... Yeah. Is chat gone from the box? From the... the... Oh no, it's just no, people it's... have... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it yeah. filled down yet. Got it, gotcha. Lorp says we already finished talk... talking about Sonic porn. Oh, we missed Sonic porn? Too bad. <laughs> Ooh, here's a sword. That's definitely a sword for sure. You get sword! I love when you get sword. Kaya, what do you get? Sword! Yes. Ooh, sword light. Yes! Magic sword plus one! Let's wreck. Wait, did sword light become magic sword plus one? Uh huh. Did you examine uh -oh, it? Uh oh. You're oh, like, I know like this is a light sword, but there. what kind of light sword? Yeah. A oh, sword dang. that fucks up zombies. I legitimately really enjoy playing this game. Yeah, uh, wrong button. Getting all the buttons mixed up. You know how I do. Mm hmm. Is that where his plate armor? Am I like too heavy or something? Oh boy, look at this guy right here. Carrying Max, equip Max. Carry, equipped. Okay, 
So I'm not at my maximum yet. He's put some armor over his uh, pajamas. Well, he wants to be able to take it off and get, go right to sleep. I totally understand that right now. I like how he just tears open the graves. He's just like fucking, oh god. Like they must be, he must have the strongest hands or those are the weakest graves. Yeah. It can be both. It cannot be both. It has to be either extreme. Well, it can be the weakest grave meets the strongest man. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, so it can be both extremes. I thought you were saying, like, they could be, like, a kind of weak grave, and he could have pretty strong hands. Like, no, it's gotta be. Yeah, no, I, I, I right. So he oh. could, he could already be tearing apart gravestones, and then he comes across this, and it's like, this is a fucking joke. Yeah. <clears throat> Don't mess with this. Don't. Do not. What? Who's messing with this? <laughs> oh, he can go from... Wow, he's running fast. What's up with that? He's running fast? This, seems like, this guy seems like he starts running faster than before. Talking about highlight? Yeah, it seems like Highlight's booking it. Maybe the magic and the sword is making us run faster. Um, are we for sure gonna do um the? Are we gonna do Donkey Kong at some point? Is that happening? Yes. So, are you doing that sooner or later? Like, if I go lay down for a while? Uh, yeah. If you want to lay down, that's fine. People are talking about how your stream needs to be at least 25 hours. <laughs> they cray. I mean, we have the time, right? Yeah. Right? Yeah. I'm not asking you. I, I uh, don't know. I guess so. Oh, the world wraps. I didn't have to walk all the way across. I could have just gone. Oh, no. Oh, that's but now we got that sweet mountaineering experience. Apparently. What? You don't want to get you don't want to get points into mountaineering? I don't think Hyde Lied levels up in mountaineering. Well, you should be because you should be jumping to get points in athletics. Hyde Lied can't jump. Well, yeah, because you're not jumping. All the more reason he needs points in athletics. This, yeah, this situation is more severe than I thought. Oh, what's that? You get nice. should get people on Skype because they would be talking. Yeah, well, here's what I gotta do. I wanna make some coffee and then I also have to I have to, I have to go where there's phone service to see if my coworker talks to me about stuff. Um, do you want coffee also? I would rather have my last rifle. I can get that. You only have three hours left, so... Fading. Well, now that I'm standing, I feel good. Ugh, it's amazing what standing up can do to you.
see. Like, I feel like I really want to eat sure. something sugary, and I am very worried that that would make me feel worse. Yeah. But that's, like, all I can think about eating right now. People are telling us to talk. I don't know. What do you want us to talk yeah, about? I, oh wait, that's just Courtney to listen to her. Yeah. Uh, I want to get Paul back on. Because he's in a part of the world where it's like the middle of the day. He shouldn't be exhausted. I think. I want to not feel like death. I don't know how to do that. I don't either. Tofu yogurt, what the fuck is that? Well, no, so the problem is that um, I'm in my 25th week now, and for the last couple weeks, I've been having this problem where anytime I eat a thing at all whatsoever, sugary, high-carbo, low-carb, etc., if I have some juice, etc., it doesn't seem to matter I immediately feel like I am just dying. Like I feel like really heavy and sluggish and I can't breathe. And so I had a little bit of calzone leftovers because they were right in front of me and I figured that would be a thing that I could eat. Um, and I feel like death, but I am craving slash wanting to eat something sugary. And I don't think that's going to help. Tofu yogurt sounds pretty fucking terrible though. Tofu yogurt. What's the noises? What's wrong? Uh, no, there's just some options that in the menu that just say not working. <laughs> Super uh, helpful. Too bad scaling and fit screen is not working. That'd be cool. I mean, I wasn't planning on playing this just yet, but I guess people heard the music and everyone's like, yeah! So, I guess now I have to. Uh... GT Goku 1999 says, "Ask Kyle if he wants to do a let's watch of old Mario shows with Keith and Kyle commenting over it." I, um, I'm not really interested in doing almost any let's watches. Keith is very interested in it, so we'll see what happens. cannot think of a name was asking how we met because they missed the story you're gonna have to watch on youtube in like a year when all the videos are up ouch well either you'll get them all done and up before the baby comes or eventually <laughs> i'll get them There won't be a ton of problems with these ones like the last one. I don't think so. I can hear someone saying hello. It's cute. Oh, okay. So 
Hasn't been on for that long. No, but it is boxed in. And we'll save it and end for now anyways. <laughs> <laughs> we could play Donkey Konga now. Um, yeah, we could. No. Uh, Havoc Pioneer wants to know if me, Kyle, or Keith are going to be getting the new 3DS. I still don't even have a 3DS at all because they cost monies. Um, Kyle, I, I don't... He's not making any sneaky faces to make me believe that he's planning on getting one without telling me. No. And I, I mean, I don't I don't even really know how Keith feels about handheld games, but from what I do know about him, I, it doesn't seem like a thing he would be jumping at. I mean, I would like to have it just because it seems nicer. It has like the weird 3D tracking, but it's not really like enough to warrant. Like, because if I was going to get it, I'd probably have to sell my 3DS and stuff. So, it doesn't seem worth it. Plus, like, I'd be interested to have, like, the second analog nub, but from what I hear, it doesn't sound that comfortable anyways, and at this point, I don't, like, I'm the kind of guy that if I was going to need a second stick or something, I'd rather pay $15 for, like, a, for one of the Circle Pad Pro add-on things, because I don't really, I don't, I don't think, I never thought that thing was as hideous as we've made it out to be, but. Keith, are you planning on getting the new 3DS? Um, I don't use my regular Thank 3DS you. enough to justify a second one. That's what I thought. Uh, if they had, like, a really sweet trade-in deal, like, if they were like, turn in your old 3DS and get the new one for, like, way, way less money, and I mm. happen to have any money, no, I, I still wouldn't. Or play Nuclear Throne. That's fun, this will be fun. Test, 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 test. Turst. I feel really quiet. Man, I don't really test. Oh, test, I hear test. you. I think I'm I think I'm I think I think it's probably the back side is quieter than the front side. That's why like people keep going back and forth about me being quiet. Or this might be quiet or not. Um, but we'll, we'll figure it out. Um. Can you turn my headphones up a bit? Yeah. You're this one? I'm um, number two? Yeah, thank you. That good? Yeah. Why is this dripping? Is this mug going to have a leak or a crack? This does mug does have a leak oh, or a crack. Oh no! My mug is broken? That, that sounds... Was, that wasn't exactly what I meant. What did you mean? What did you want me to do? Just put the cup on inside. <laughs> put the mug inside the cup for now. Like that? Yeah. I guess. This. I feel like this is a more permanent solution. Oh, yeah. I was like, I was like, how can I you keep spilling it? It's fine. These are, these are spare pants. My main pants are upstairs. These are backup pants. Good music. Yeah, I agree. Gets more. Get, I, don't, I don't know. Blow some up. Oh, I don't. Hmm. Are those like little birdies? What is that? I can't see from here. It looked like these are bullet. bullet shells on the ground. Um, Paul says, "Hey guys, I got a call from Keith going, but I can't hear anything." Oh. Oh. I also on. can't hear him. So. Yeah.
Hey, Paul. Hello. Hey. Hi. There Hello. we go. What's up, Paul? Hey. There we go. Yeah. How's it going? Awesome. So I'm real sleepy, <laughs> Paul. Uh, I can tell. <laughs> Did you? I don't know if you've been in the chat room. Yeah. I was. I yes. was under a blanket and I was dozing a little bit. Oh. I wasn't asleep, but I was definitely like, I wish I wasn't awake or have to be awake. And then I, <laughs> I stood up, and as soon as I stood up, I felt better, and now I've got this coffee, so soon I'll feel even worse. <laughs> but I'll be awake. I'll, I'll, I'll feel worse, but be awake doing it. Yeah. You guys are almost there, though. Yeah, well... You know what? They're almost there, but then, just like last year, someone's going to be like, well, if we donate $100, we guys go for another hour? Well, and yeah, then everyone's going to donate money. Of course. <laughs> yeah. But the thing is that... It's it's even I'm already there like the end of the marathon I always get all my energy back and I get excited also just because like my body wakes back up because it's daytime yeah so. mm -hmm. damn you and circadian rhythms yeah. oh oh what do I do ah oh, whoops my circadian <laughs> rhythms are syncopated as shit ooh ooh how do I get that. How do I... That was a very good music uh, insomnia uh, joke. Oh no, oh no, no. You did not I reach the nuclear machine. throne. I can talk about the game a bit if you guys want. Yeah. How do I sure. pick things up? It's, uh, Start with that. Are you using a controller? Because then it yeah. would be X, I think? No, I think the game broke. Which controller are you using? Xbox, Xbox 360. 360. Okay, yeah, then it's totally X. I think the game broke. Broke. Um, Kyle's computer's been having some issues lately. Oh no! Well, this is also non-final. Um, the I lost my thought whole my whole thought thing. <laughs> I just shut my computer because like an like an idiot. I left my I left it unplugged for too long, so I wasn't able to charge it. So I had to shut it so I could charge it. Which is the fucking weirdest problem of all time. Yeah. Oh right, it's your weird like it's my, yeah. the fifty percent thing, right? Yeah, yeah. It was actually like it was actually at like sixty percent and still still stopped charging. I don't know what That's so weird. It's super weird. It's a problem that doesn't make any sense. The, this is the part of the story, Paul, that I think I left out. Like the sound card that was broken for a year, like I couldn't plug headphones into it. I could like the only way to get sound was to to plug in an external USB sound card. Like one day, a I have year... that same problem with my laptop. Really? This laptop, I have that too. Yep. <laughs> one day, a year into having it be busted like that, I was watching. I like I was watching a YouTube video, and five minutes into the YouTube video, I was like, "Oh, I'm listening to this through my through the speakers." I'm not supposed to be able to be doing that. And then since then, it's been totally fine, and I don't know what happened. <laughs> That's really weird. It was really weird. It was a very good day, and then also the second USB port started working too, like out of wow. nowhere. Like, I don't know wow. what I did. Like, maybe I dropped it in the right <laughs> way. That's pretty good, though. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I felt, it was like, it's, I felt like if, uh, if, like, in Happy Days, like, Fonzie fell into the jukebox, and that's what had, like, instead of being cool and hitting it, he just tripped into it. What did you do? <laughs> you blew up. I don't, I don't know what happened. Um, I just tweeted, um, if you guys want to retweet that. I cannot. I don't have enough. I don't have a retweet. Oh no, I do have my phone. Um, it's in my pocket. Uh, uh. Were you not following Run Button, Kyle? Did you just add Run Button? No, I. I, re <laughs> I re no, I retweeted with both my. Oh, I was like, what? That would have been a little crazy. Um, Paul, some people are asking what, uh, what Nuclear th Throne is all about. Excuse me. Alright. So, Nuclear Throne is this, like, top-down shooter with roguelike elements. So, you choose your character, and then you fight your way through randomly generated levels. Uh, you find weapons, and you level up. And as soon as you die, you go all the way back to square one uh, with a couple things saved, like unlocked characters and stuff. Mm -hmm. um, you have to make it to the nuclear throne, which is the final boss. Uh, if you beat the final boss, the game loops around and goes back to the first level, but it's harder 
and it keeps building up like that. So you're saying this is a game designed to make Kyle explode and die? Yes. Okay. <laughs> After unzero sleep. Um, one of the best characters to like learn the game with is Crystal because she can shield. Okay. So she's one of the easier characters. Kyle, who are you playing right now? Rogue. I think. Yeah, Rogue this? is our uh, like super hard mode character. <laughs> okay. Wait, what? You're actually playing the super hard mode character. <laughs> oh. You she, fucked up. She shoots a bunch of bullets when I yeah, shoot the gun. So people easy. keep saying. <laughs> I just easy, noticed in the chat, right? people are saying, please stop him from playing Rogue for now. Okay. God, he keeps choosing Rogue. Oh my God. It's the gun seemed a lot better. I don't know. And Blazing Raven is better, says, um, what oh, happens with Rogue is that she spawns. Uh, the police, which normally don't appear this early in the game. Which oh, so Crystal. Um, oh, so Kyle, you're getting extra enemies because you're playing this game. Yeah. It, it seemed like it was harder, but I wasn't sure how, <laughs> how random the difficulty was. Like, maybe I just got a super easy seed the first time. Um, well, it's no it's no symbol symbol butts, I'll, t I'll say that. Yeah, it's no ma female symbol, male symbol, butts. Butts it will do. Butts it will do. Um, ooh. Well, are you shooting more bullets than you were a second ago? Uh-huh. Nice. Take that bonus all right. There. Quick question. Yeah. Has anybody let Bethany out? Um, I've seen Bethany. Okay, I'm gonna I've go... I've heard of Bethany. I'm gonna I've go heard. let Bethany out. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Oh! Um, Kyle, somebody asked if you have gotten any documents from Patreon, like a W-2 or a 1099. No. I bet um, if you go, we can go on later. All I've done is they had me fill out a, uh, w, uh, W-9. Okay. That's it. Um... Yeah, is that a shotgun? I so uh, what so from here what I what I know is a scorpion because I'm sitting pretty far away from the thing and oh. it's at a weird angle. What I know is a scorpion looks like a slowpoke. <laughs> I know that it's a scorpion. We we've had uh, a different streamer call them Ratatas. So. Oh really? <laughs> yeah. Oh, people are just like getting all the Pokemon up in here. <laughs> um, just turning the TV off for fun. Yeah, I hate that TV. Fuck this TV. Game pause. Enter. Oh, this is a... We're gonna have to... We're gonna have to switch off. Not now. When you... When you're... When you've lost horribly a couple more times. Um, Paul, I think my plan is to beat the whole game in one go. Without ever dying even once. And that's Sounds my good. goal. I want to see that. That's yeah. That's my goal, and I'm per like I'm eighty percent sure that I can do it. Like I'm not being unreasonable. A like I'm giving myself a twenty percent margin of error. <laughs> but the game has a very broken co-op mode, by the way. If you guys want to play two player, is it like same keyboard two player? Uh, it's two controllers or uh, one controller and one key key mouse. Okay. I think. Yeah. Yeah. You should be able to toggle that on in the options. Oh, cool. Is it yeah. broken just because it's not balanced for two people yet? Yeah, right? we just we just added it in and then we didn't touch it. Uh, and we're probably just, we're gonna polish it up eventually. But right. Right now it's not a priority, mm -hmm. so. Because we, up, we push updates out like every week for this game. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Yeah. This is, uh... Giant Bomb gave this an award for best early access experience. Yeah, I actually didn't realize that it was early access because of the way that people talked about it uh, when I guess it first went early access. Um, mm -hmm. Until I didn't realize it until like uh, today. So, <laughs> um, so you can it, switch weapons, by the way, uh, Kyle. I oh. think it's with. Why? But I'm not sure. Oh, there we go. Are you in danger of running out of ammo? Oh, okay. Yeah, you can. You can definitely run out of ammo. Uh, it's very much about ammo management, which is why the game doesn't shoot when you push a direction on the second stick. 
you have to push another button because otherwise people would just do like twin stick shooting all around right. them and right. run out of them. Okay. Did you just like pick a new thing? Is that what you did? I got to a new level. Oh, a new level. Okay. No. Nope. Uh, Kyle has not died since you left. Okay. Um, I told the stream that I would show you. Nicole is showing off the Sonic hoodies around me. They have custom shoes. <laughs> I will call them. Custom, custom shoes. <laughs> Thank you, Alberto Robert. I will treasure these my entire life. Oh, you will no. live on through these shoes in my heart. Bethany has been out and rolled in the snow, and the cats and the dog have food and water. Your black cat's being weird. What do you mean? I guess just being needy. Oh, she was. She, they haven't. They didn't, their water dish wasn't even out. Oh, okay. And they didn't have breakfast, so that makes sense now. They're hungry. She was like running at me and like yelling at me. <laughs> like, yeah. <laughs> that sounds like, very much like she wants like, food. Calm, calm down, cat. I understand that you need something. I don't know what you're saying. Please speak more calmly. <laughs> and then she was like, rah, 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 and then it didn't help. Hmm. What's up? Nothing. Um. um. So Trisket out said, "Who's joining them?" That's Paul, who is the artist for Nuclear Throne. Mm -hmm. Ooh. It's cool times. Mm -hmm. Paul drew all three pieces of wood that appear multiple times <laughs> in this. <laughs> Why is the chat so slow? That's a good question. Um, sometimes Twitch is broken and sometimes your computer's broken and you'll never know which, which of the two it is. is. No one will ever figure it out. What are, the, what are the green things I'm picking up? Uh, it's radiation. Oh. So when you pick up enough radiation, you level up and you can choose a new mutation if you get to the next level. Oh, oh man. And those add like, you can get like extra um, HP or oh. they do weirder things like if you use a shell weapon like a shotgun, one of the mutations um, makes those shells bounce further. So if they're shot in like a tiny alley or something, you can make them bounce off the wall and travel really far. It's pretty dope. Oh yeah, you did pick a thing. Yeah, I just I just saw that. Okay. My keyboard is being the worst. Is it like not responding or is it just yeah. a weird shape? There is some you know what keyboard I hate? I hate Kyle, I hate your keyboard. Yeah, I do too. I feel like I just can't type on your keyboard. I don't know what it is. Yeah, you know what it is? What? You guys are nub casuals. No, <laughs> I've got like a you're badass. Not, you're not intense enough for the Logitech G15 gaming keyboard. I've got like a. I've got like a. One's got it's like a mechanical keyboard and it's nice and it's fun and then yours is like a sponge. It's like you typing on your keyboard is like typing into a sponge cake with icing on it and your hands are sticky and wet and it's like sorry. what even was I'm this sorry that i can't buy a mechanical keyboard <laughs> oh man if we could buy a mechanical keyboard <laughs> i didn't so sweet to be fair i didn't buy it as a gift as a birthday gift um it was on a dope sale where it came with a nice mouse um oh, oh god oh no oh no oh, trisket no. out says to paul awesome tell him he's great and to do more work Thank you. Paul, you're awesome and great, and do more work. Work harder. Oh. What's wrong with you? Why won't you work God harder? <laughs> <laughs> Been working uh, on this goddamn game for forever. <laughs> uh, Jesus Balls says, "How do you guys know Paul? And is Paul a Run Button fan?" Yes. Yes. I um, started watching like during the Sonic thing, like pretty much everybody, I think. <laughs> um, not me. <laughs> I, her buddy. I wish I wish everybody started watching run button videos would be helpful. Yeah, if everybody started if everybody watching. started watching them. <laughs> I want us to be as popular as that Sonic fan game 
it was in that Sonic Fan Games universe. Oh, God. 900 million views. 900 million, yeah. Uh, it's gotta happen. It's, yeah. I feel like we can do it. I feel like we're right there. I would also settle for being uh, one of their biggest competitors, like Mobius Networks or whatever it was. Or Prowers something. I don't know. It was dumb. Oh, man. Uh, yeah, I've, I've like... Uh, I have I have known Paul through Paul have like tweeting like in my direction for like kind of a while. Yeah. Yeah. It's like this year or uh, I mean 2014. Yeah. Probably. Yeah. Tweeted a bunch. And... Um, that's fun. Paul, you're a nice guy. Thank you. And your game you was really cool. Yeah. All right. I'm very glad that you guys invited me uh, for this thing. Thank you very much. Yeah, these are hanging out during during Sonic 06 and during what else? Did, what did we do before that? I can't have any memory I, of the order of things know. anymore. Uh, Resident Evil. Resident Evil. EDF. Oh yeah, EDF. Yeah, that's what I was thinking of. And Smash Brothers. Mm -hmm. <sighs> um, Paul, I don't think I have met you. I met Rami at uh, Boston Fig, not this past Boston Fig, but the previous mm -hmm. Boston Fig. Um, but if you were at PAX East last year, I might have inadvertently spoken to you slash met you and not realized it, um, because I was doing a Polygon, uh, community meetup scavenger hunt, and your yeah. nuclear throne booth was one of the stops. I have never been to PAX. Oh, it's so much fun. <laughs> it's, it's kind of bad, like... We usually let Rami handle packs, <laughs> and like nobody else goes. <laughs> um, so that's kind of bad. I should probably go sometime. It's um, so much fun. Yeah, they planned it during GDC again this year. Yeah, is, is it during year, or is it right after? The first day, the they last day of GDC is the first day of PAX. Yeah, I think that's the same as last year. And I, I, yeah, I don't know if it was the same or last year. There was like a day in between, but it's it's like still it was ridiculous and yeah, it's, it's terrible the same thing. and. Yeah. Uh, it, I feel even worse about it knowing that every year I go to PAX, I have less fun at PAX. Um, and then I'm like, PAX, we even step on all the other fun things' toes. Um, <laughs> I will say I really enjoy Boston Fig. I think if, in, if you're in the New England area um, ever, and for our listeners who are in New England, it's a really, really cool event to go to. It's the Boston Festival of Indie Games. And the tickets are like $10 a piece or something. They were free last year, but the event cost has gone up so much because they had so many developers. And it's it's in MIT, and they use this year they used uh, the track room, which was huge. And it was it just looks like the world's biggest science fair of indie games. I'll say this. Boston really Fig cool. just sounds like it a is. cookie. And they have panels and stuff, which were really neat. I, I actually did a panel on parenting and gaming um, with some neat indie devs and um, media people who are parents or have parenting uh, media, I guess, uh, like engaged family gamer. Um, and but there was a lot of there was a lot of cool panels on narrative. Um, there was a lot of panels on culture and a lot of Boston area professionals like lawyers and accountants and stuff will do panels that are specifically targeted towards people who want to start their own indie company. Um, so it's, it's super informative and they do a lot of different um, like c contests, you know, most obviously most conventions have some kind of like awards or whatever, but they. Uh, they do like a student prize, they do like a, a best uh, student game, and they do best narrative and best artwork, and uh, they do a game jam also at the same time, and so there's there's a lot of cool, it's a really neat little, it's a one day convention, which is super exciting. It's only one day? <laughs> it's only it's one day. It's, and it's, 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 it is pretty huge. Last year they had, um, I want to say about 10,000 people, and the year before that they had 7,500 people. Um, there's a lot of kids. There's a lot of families that go. This year they had a family corner, and it was just a bunch of developers with kids-specific games. So that was like one whole area, and they had face painters and little beanbag chairs and stuff. And then they had an entire separate auditorium that was just filled with tabletop, tabletop um, exhibitions. So like the track room was full of like science fair-esque uh, digital showcase, and then they had an entire room that was a tabletop showcase, and same idea. It was very science fairish. Um, you can buy some games like there are very, very varied states of completion, uh, which was really neat. And people who aren't even close to finishing are like actively looking for feedback. So everyone is basically a play tester, 
And then there are games that are finished and you can just buy them and they have like Square on their phone and you can just buy a game and take it home with you. Um, and then they also have an art exhibit and they do, they get people to send over some original drawings from artwork from games that have already published or they have contests to see who can get into it and it's pretty neat. It's definitely a cool event. It's in September every year. That sounds really cool, yeah. It's a good time. I should go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, a, it's about 10% the size of PAX and it has the same mm. atmosphere without any of that like just craziness that is the schedule and the sheer volume of games and people and the yeah. price yeah pax seems really overwhelming PAX it can is, be pax can be overwhelming pax is like um pax can be really fun if you do a good job of scheduling things that you want to do. And it's yeah. different for you because you would be like at a booth yeah um so it's a totally different experience but as someone who's like walking around and trying to like figure out the thing like like see the things that are there top of knowing what you want to do and when you end up feeling super busy and then also accomplishing nothing yeah mm -hmm. um i feel like over the past couple of years i've transitioned to going to more panels and less spending time on the game floor uh, because it's just too crazy. Last year I had a yeah. media badge, so I was able to get in an hour early on day one, and that was pretty much like all I needed. <laughs> I was all set after that. <laughs> yeah, I don't at GDC. I don't even go like to the expo anymore. I just go to the talks, or not even go into the building at all. Yeah, that's yeah. I went to E3 a couple years ago, and even that felt less overwhelming than PAX. Wow. Because they have more space for what less did? games. Uh, E3. Oh, okay. They have just the way that they lay it out. Um, it was overwhelming in that the big booths like um, you know Sony and, and Microsoft and EA, like those booths were really over the top and they were really loud. And that was kind of challenging. But in terms of the sheer volume of people, like there wasn't, a, there really weren't many times oh. that I can remember where I was like, oh, fun? I can't uh, physically get through this space. We might not be. It might just uh -huh. be me. Um, no, it does does not say live anymore on my end. Oh, no, it does. Now it does. Yeah. Yeah. Mine said, was said that it was offline, but it was because I had my thing closed. PAX is really good for the panels. Kyle and I are actually panelists on a panel this year, which is pretty cool. Ooh. Yeah, we're doing a panel about parenting and gaming with some pretty cool people. That's cool. I um, think so. I still don't have a badge, so it's up in there. If I'm even gonna be there, who we knows? have two full weekend badges. I know you did tell me, but also you can't pull the "I don't even have a badge" card when we have two. I guess. <laughs> I guess. Well, I have access to badge. I don't know. I'll go. I'll go. It'll be fine. Just gotta pay us face value for those badges. <laughs> I'll. Well, I just. I don't know. I don't know yeah. if I'll go. It's uh, it's good times. Pax is fun. I like the I like the free play areas a lot. Those are fun. I yeah. feel like when I, in the free play areas, it's sometimes fun because you're going and you're playing a video game that you don't have that it like and like oh well, let's play this weird thing for a little while, and and that's like but that's also not three days worth of fun. Yeah. What is that? Is that like? They random ha games or something they have they have these free play rooms like are they have an arcade free free, free play room and then a, like two different console free play rooms classic console and, and then current console right and you basically like you give them your your, your license right yep. do you give them your license and then they're like okay what game do you want and then you're like i'll take this game yeah they have a huge library of games you can go up and just be like oh i want yeah uh, Super Mario World 3 for whatever and blah 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 here's my license and they tell you which system that you're assigned to and then you just go swap out the games that you want yeah it's mm -hmm. cool because you get a lot of pickup games yeah and you get a lot of you can find a lot of really weird shit too um and so those are those those, those are fun um there's some there's always some really interesting panels and then mm -hmm. um but it's like a lot and like going to Boston is a, the worst <laughs> yeah, we already have a hotel. My friend Max is coming from Canada, um, and we got his badge for him because he wasn't going to be able to make the craziness work with getting a badge. What are you trying to set up? Nothing. Okay. I, I, I broke it, and now I'm fixing it. People are asking for Donkey Konga. <laughs> <laughs> 
We did that last marathon, and that was a lot of fun. Yeah, I I caught up on the last marathon like last week or something. <laughs> so it seems like super. Um, it doesn't seem like that long ago for me that you guys yeah. did that. So like the what again? <laughs> Well, someone came into the stream earlier and was saying like, oh, hey, I just finished watching all of the YouTube marathon uh, videos while I was struggling with insomnia. And then I realized that you were in the middle of another 24 hour marathon. <laughs> and they were like, is this some kind of weird fever dream? Um, so that's kind of funny. Uh, Kyle, uh, Desiwell would like Keith to have a shot at Nuclear Throne. I can do that. I can fucking take a bunch of shots at a bunch of jerks that are trying to kill me in Nuclear Throne. Is what I can do. It's good times. Yeah. Are you going to finish it in one go? In one go. <laughs> 100% no deaths. Nuclear Throne. <laughs> First try. I think PAX is going to be really bizarre for me this year because I'm going to be uh, approximately 30 weeks pregnant. Yeah, 30 weeks. So that'll be a challenge. The good thing about PAX is that you don't really have to walk anywhere. Uh, that's not true. I think it's absolutely true. I've never had to step a single foot at PAX. Thanks to the scooters that they provide. What? Gratis. That's, that's shenanigans. Uh, I've done volunteering with Take This Org before, and the AFK room this year is located right next to Bumblebee Theater, which is conveniently the theater that our panel is in. So I'm really hoping that I can get a hold of someone from Take This and be like, hey, do you want a big old pregnant person to sit and volunteer in your room for just indefinitely? <laughs> because I could do that. <laughs> <laughs> um... Keith, what's your favorite dinosaur? Stegosaurus. Really? Bar none. Hell yeah, Stegosaurus. Yeah, yeah Stegosaurus. Why Stega? Because um, it's dope. Look at these so guys. Stegosaurus, bunch of... like, I don't have a favorite dinosaur, but, like, it's not a bad choice. It's pre Stegosaurus is pretty dope. Stegosaurus is pretty good. Keith, I just, spent, yeah, uh, I just spent, like, 15 minutes setting up Nuclear Throne on the... Nuke, nuke Throne? <sighs> nuke Throne on the TV. You mind if I do one more <laughs> round? Go for it. My favorite dinosaur is Procompsognathid. Look at that. I think he's awesome. Look at that. It's super cool. But like, are he's you... He's got a bunch of knives on his back and Do his you tail. like him because of how he looks or because of his cool special skills? Any, all of it. There's the full package. Well, what is the thing that you said? Procompsognathid. Uh, Procompsognathid. Also known as Compies. Compies. Compy dinosaurs. Compies are cute. They are very cute and they have tiny little... Chompies? Teeth. No, Compies. Chompies? Yeah, sure. Um, they have tiny little teeth, oh, and yeah, they have guys. venom in their teeth. So, like, that tiny little dinosaur that's, like, the size of a chicken can jump on you and just be like, bite you here, and, and bite you, like, five or six times, and then you get really sleepy, and they just rip oh, you that apart. that sounds good. Well, that, that part. The part yeah. up until where they rip me apart. <laughs> like, a cute, a cute little lizard jumps on me, bites me, and then I can take a nap. Like, that sounds fine up until when I'm food. Yeah. Well, I mean, that's kind of the whole point. Like, if like then food. he just, like, kind of hung out, I'd be into it. <laughs> um, I also like Ducky. I think he's a plesiosaur. Yeah. No. No, I'm wrong. That's the ocean one. Hmm. This is a terrible mistake. What, setting it up on the TV? Yeah. <laughs> How come? Because it just didn't terrible, work? Terrible, terrible mistake. Because it just meant that I had to redo everything. That's unfortunate. It looks like there's a dispute about Ducky from the Land Before Time's species. Um, is consistently identified in the official material as a Parasaurophilus. There seems to be a, a, I have to admit, much confusion over what species Ducky is for, for viewers and fans alike. alike. Man, I'm getting tired. Might be a Sorolophus or a Parasaurolophus. It could be either of those. <laughs> Much confusion. Myasaur? 
No, am I a sword? Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Thank you. Mm, what do we got here? I am a sneezy boy. Um. Oh, someone just made a joke. A dino joke. That's pretty funny. It must have been from when I asked you what you liked about Stegosaurus. Yeah. And Metamako <laughs> says, because Stega does what Nintendo don't. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Does Nintendo don't hire 300 people in a day? Because I feel like Sega is uh, um, not really racking up any karma points with their recent layoffs. It's pretty rough. Here's what I think. I think they should fucking put out an official English patch for Fantasy Star Online 2. Is what I think. The, and I think that would solve the worst it. Is, there is an official English version, but it's only in Southeast Asia. Oh, that's right. Right, yeah. Although, you we, you can just get that version. Yeah, you can just get that patch. Like, no, I hate when people say that. Like, I don't want to take the time... Like it took me ridiculous. like it took me like forty minutes. I don't want to have to hack your game. Like it's in English. Just let me play it. Yeah. Um, it's weird because it's like free to play, and so it doesn't like really need a, a launch. Real like there's they wouldn't have to do anything. There's no box cop. Like I don't understand yeah. why they think the f where the effort yeah. comes in. Yeah. I, well, I think I they like they feel the need to localize the voice, which would take. A long time you know, and way too much money. money and a bit of time yeah. that they don't really have. But yeah, like at this point, at this point, who cares? Just point it, put it out the way it is. I would say. Yeah. Um, yeah. I mean, I, they do the same with Yakuza. Like they don't care about true localized voices. So whatever. <laughs> I don't think anybody cares. No. No. Oh. I'm I can tell you that I don't care, and that <laughs> I had a lot of fun with Fantasy Star Online too when I was playing it. Me too. It's really good. Man, that game's great. Oh, we have an Ask FM question that I missed. Um, and that is, wh who is your favorite rapper? Um, uh, of all time or currently? Oh, sorry, what are your favorite rap artists? Just, that's all it is. Um, I have been re-listening to a lot of Souls of Mischief recently, which is one, like, uh, specifically the album 93 to Infinity, which I think is really good. Um... So that's where I'm at, rap-wise. Kyle. Oh. I'll take this thing from you. Thank you. Um, I don't know. I've never really listened to a ton of rap. Like, Eminem is the only rap artist that I've listened to, like, a lot of. So I guess Eminem. Um. I gotta go to the bathroom again. What the you drink a Red Bull. Yeah. Did you break the seal? Because that's your problem. I'm gonna be fish. <laughs> Paul, I'm gonna be fish. Tell me about fish. Fish, I guess I don't fish has a question. slow ass firing rate and it's bullshit. <laughs> fish can roll though. Ooh. Fish can roll. How do I roll? Uh, I can run. Oh special, yeah, there we go. So I think it's trigger or something. Yeah. I, my stream is way behind, by the way. So. Oh, you don't have screen share. I do not. Um. So, I really like Twenty One Pilots, um, which is like a rap. Uh, alternative indie rock fusion. Um, a lot of their lyrics are of a rap nature. I, I mean, if we're gonna go fusions, I also really like Groovis Malt's album, um, uh, uh, Sound Soldiers. Um, that is sort of like a a, I would I would call it a f like a funk jazz sort of album. Um, that they do a lot of really interesting stuff with time signatures, and then also most of most of the lyrics are just rapping. Um, they're not the best rappers, but they do rap, and it's good. Paul, um, do you have a favorite rap artist? Um, I only recently really got into rap because of my girlfriend. Fair enough. Um, Sounds like a keeper. I really like, I like Chance, and I like Gangstar a lot. <laughs> Those are like the two that I've been like really listening to lately. I mean, everybody likes Chance. Pretty much, yeah. Yeah. Fucking some 10 day. Is this chat broken again? Uh, I don't know. I think it is. Vodka, Vodka Flocka Flame, Flame says, I swear she makes up half the artists. <laughs> you like, no, they're all real. <laughs> it's so funny. I don't know why you think I'm making that up. It would just take a Google search. Groove of Small Sound Soldiers. Unless you thought I was making up Souls of Mischief, which is... 
Um, Grew Small is technically a, a, a local-ish band. They're from Providence, Rhode Island. Um, and they put out a couple albums, and then they haven't been around for years. Um, some kills regenerate HP, yeah. If I'm going, I mean, if I'm going for a straight up, if I'm going to go for a run, like I'm going for. <laughs> oh yeah, another thing about Fish is that he gets more ammo than the other characters. Oh dang, that's great news. Yeah, he finds, he finds a little bit more ammo, um... Because of he used to be a cop, that's like his backstory. Okay. He, he the the whole apocalypse that changed everybody into mutants happened like one day before his retirement. Was he a fish already, or did he mutate into a fish? Did was he, he mutated just... into a fish? Okay, <laughs> so he wasn't just a fish cop. No. I don't. I don't mean to diminish fish cops. <laughs> Is it a, quite an accomplishment to be a fish cop? Shit, low bullets. Right. Um, Desi Well says, "Oh, Keith, you introduced me to giraffes, giraffes, and I have Ooh. to say I really like them." So yeah, thanks. no problem. Giraffes, giraffes is great. Uh, giraffes, giraffes is a. Actually, they've gotten pretty big, but they they're. Uh, I, I died. Um, I did not. I did not. I, this is the twenty percent that I was worried about. Um. <laughs> um. Would be. I'm gonna be eyes. No, I'm not gonna be eyes. Um, they're like a, they're sort of like a math, they're a two-piece math rock band. A lot of looping, um, a lot of harmonies spaced out by like really sort of an intense arrhythmic sections. It's good. They're good. Keith, have you ever heard of that one guy? That one guy? Mm -hmm. No. You would love him, I think. Yeah? He's really cool. Has anybody in the chat heard of that one guy? Um, Paul, I would be I would be extremely shocked if you had heard of him. Um, he's, I have not. <laughs> yeah, he's a, he's a guy. Uh, he's a really, really weird guy who I'm pretty sure does a lot of drugs. And he created uh, his own instrument out of basically just parts. And um, he calls it the magic pipe, I believe. And okay. it is a pipe with uh, some string on it and some various points of contact and some various um, electronic mechanisms worked into it. And he can play said pipe in a lot of different ways. And he also has created other instruments. He he made a, uh, an instrument out of a boot. Like he amplified a boot. And then he can play the boot with uh, a... Um, bow, like for a violin. That sounds fun. And he also has amplified a saw, like the kind that you use to saw wood. And that makes some really neat stuff. And he's made some cool um, covers of like Over the Rainbow and stuff with that. It's really, really neat. And he has a couple of albums. Oh, look, there are actually some people in the chat who are familiar with him. He has a song called Weasel Pot Pie that's really funny. His live shows are frigging hilarious. Um, because I'm pretty sure he does just so much drugs. I've been to a couple of his shows, and it's there's there's just no way that he doesn't do a lot of drugs before he gets there. Um, on I will say to, uh, real quick, going back, if you do want to check out Giraffes, Giraffes, I would check out the uh, the album More Skin for Milk Mouth is the album that I really like of theirs. It's real. Well, Kyle's looking at me like it can't be real, but it's real. Yeah, people were talking about you making up names. More names. Skin for Milk no, no, no. Mouth. It's, it, <sighs> I'm not. What? It's not that I don't believe you. It's that like just that fucking name. Like what yeah, the hell? like uh, if that's it wasn't a enough to have band. a band called Giraffes, Giraffes. Their album is more Giraffe, skin Giraffes. Giraffes, I believe, is a Roll Doll reference or something. Some sort of reference. I wasted a bunch of bullets shooting that cactus for no reason. Um, <laughs> and oh, and on the subject of making in making instruments, uh, one of my other favorite bands, Bela Fleck and the Flecktones. Has uh, uh, one of the their, their drummer Future Man made his, his instrument? Uh, it's called a drumatar, and that is really cool. <laughs> so check out Future Man and his brother Victor Wooten's like the best bassist that there is. So uh, I miss Victor Wooten's brother is named Future Man. Yeah, he, and he dresses like a pirate. <laughs> <laughs> I missed a really fun comment someone made about Fish Cop. Uh, Havoc Pioneer said Fish Cop helped get legislation passed for equal opportunity for marine life in the workplace. I thought that was pretty funny. <laughs> um, homing bolts done. You don't have a bolt weapon though, Keith. You, I'm gonna get one. 
<laughs> I mean, think you actually just skipped over a crossbow, but I'm not sure. Oh. Um, on Kyle's elbow is could give me issues. I've got Kyle's tennis elbow. Uh, an Ask FM question: As professional Sonic series players, what do Kyle and Keith think of the fan-made Sonic movie? It's weird. It was really funny when we saw it. Um, yeah, it's funny. Where is what am I? I'm gonna do. Here's what I'm gonna do. What are you looking for? I'm gonna do chicken. Of games. Oh, it's right here. <laughs> I was gonna say, do you want to ask me, and I can tell you where it is. Silly. Oh. I don't know if you remember, but some of those games fall out of those things really easily. Oh man, chicken's got a sword, not a gun. Chicken can also do slow motion. If you, slow I think on, tr on controller it's left trigger to do specials. Ooh. But I'm not. Yeah, sure. yeah there up? you go. I'm gonna dodge some bullets in bullet time. What's up? Is there a limit on specials? Uh, no. Uh, one of the things that we don't want in the game is like cooldowns and stuff, so you can use your specials basically whenever you want. There's a couple hmm. that use a resource, like Rebels special can summon uh, allies to help her, but it uses her health. Um, and Melting uses dead bodies on the ground to explode them. Uh, but generally, they don't use any resources. Um, I don't know why the chat is talking about that ICP. I'm a juggalo. Don't let's not let's not. Oh no. What I'm saying is that yes, I'm a juggalo. Yeah. I'm agreeing. What's your clown name? <laughs> scary Poppins. It's Scary Poppins. <laughs> I'm gonna try chicken again. I feel like I can go far as chicken. I do that like when that chick when chicken dies, chicken runs around alive for a little bit longer. Oh, that's funny. It's a good touch. She does. If you um, if you pick up a health pack during her headless <laughs> mode, yeah, she comes back to life. Oh dang! You can keep playing. Yeah. I can't kill that. Can chicken pick up a gun or is it? Forever, I can. You can pick yeah. up a gun. Yeah, I can totally pick and then up a you gun. Can switch between weapons with uh, Y, I think. Oh, this is a good. Are we gonna run into a reach up issue? What kind of issue? Gotta get some more extender cables. I have two, so maybe not. Well, I can probably reach that way then, like I did last time. I'll just sit forward. No, I can sit over here. <laughs> Ah. Sorry, sorry. Oh, I could fuck. Can I wait? Hold on. Did I just bounce bullets back? Yeah. Yeah. yeah you can Dang. Back. Melee this is attack. A game the way, changer. The way the slow motion works is it doesn't change the rate of fire on the enemies, but it slows down the bullets. So if an enemy like a scorpion shoots a lot of bullets at the same time, they are all on top of each other instead yeah. of coming out in like a burst. This is and a so game you can changer. hit them all back in like one swing. No. I like chicken a lot. It must still be in the laundry room. My box of GameCube extensions in there. Um. That's weird. Um, chat has asked specifically. Peyote Punk has asked. Um, or sorry, Dezuo has asked. Has Keith ever been high even once? Um. I, I've told this story before, but just real quickly, I had decided that I was not interested in doing any, any drugs at all or drinking, mm -hmm. and um, being straight edge. No, not being straight edge, just not doing any drugs or drinking. Okay. And uh, the, the, I had decided just to like, just to be like, I'm not, just to be like, I don't care, like because. My friends would kind of sometimes like be weird about it, like that I was a weird hall monitor when they wanted to 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 smoke weed, and so I was like, hey, "Listen, it's fine, it's not weird." And and then I tried it, and then I just to shut them up, um, and 
I had the sensation that I was choking to death for about 20 minutes. And then I was like, I'm never doing that again. Uh, and then my girlfriend at the time was like, no, you should just, you should be, maybe if you tried it like in a better environment. And I was like, okay, I'll try it again. And then I tried it again. And then I cried for two hours um, in a row. And I didn't know why. And I wasn't like sad beforehand. And I just couldn't stop. And then I was like, well, this just isn't for me. Um, so I'm done with that. Um, so if you can call that being high, then yeah, I was high twice. Yeah, what about your Twitter? I was just going to say that. Yeah. Remember oh, when you yeah, t- took a bunch of medicine? Too. I forgot about that. Sometimes I take painkillers for pain. And uh, that... Then Sometimes you take way too many and then go on Twitter. <laughs> yeah, and then go on Twitter. And, you know, that's fun. I would say that... Um, so I have never smoked weed. Um, and it's... I actually didn't really have a lot of friends growing up that did. Um, I have always had very strong opinions about smoking of any kind because I think it's disgusting. Um, and I also have asthma, so it's a problem for me. And... The closest I've come to considering doing it was when I started working at the restaurant this year and I had a lot of friends who vape um, and who vape uh, marijuana and have figured out ways to make that happen. And I was like, I would be more open to trying it that way than I would via actually smoking it. But I also know that I have really bizarre reactions to any and all kinds of medications. So it's one of those things that kind of like you said, like it once you've done it, you're then stuck in that place for however long it takes you to come down yeah um once that it was being 20 said minutes, once it was two hours yeah which even 20 minutes sounds like way too long for me like especially if it was a feeling like you described like feeling like you're choking or something that's just yeah i felt like i, I couldn't like i couldn't like i was like ugh. i was like hey if this gets any worse you have to take me to the hospital um a disc gun no but i want this um but yeah so someone then said uh talking about opiate meds so i have been put on a variety of medications for the majority of my life because i have fibromyalgia and some other issues and also uh, a migraine condition so i've kind of always been that person who knows way too much about uh, prescription medications and various opiates without crossing the line of being someone who would use them recreationally or at least abusively recreationally um and I think that that actually has been helpful, having that access since I was like 12, being constantly given prescriptions for things like oxycodone and Percocet and Vicodin and Dilaudid and th- like being just sent home from the emergency room with like, here's 25 of these. Good luck. Have a nice day. Um, and I've been so terrified of the possibility of becoming addicted because it's a huge culture down here. There's a huge problem with opiate addiction. So I think that has also kind of influenced me. It sounds like sounds like it could be fun for some people, but... I also think that it makes some people turn into total idiots. Hey, you're dead. You want to play Donkey Kong? Yes, yeah, play Donkey Konga. Mm-hmm. Let's donker a conger. So when Andy was here, I learned that one of Bongo sets doesn't work. Clap right? Sensor doesn't work, so we have to test them first to make sure that. Okay. Okay. Um, Rimjet says thanks for keeping me sane during three years of college finals and other and other tough times. You're welcome, Rimjet. Thank you for twenty dollars. Thank oh, you. did you see the one from Cannot Think of a Name? Uh, no. You guys have given me hours of entertainment. Thanks for doing this and keep up the good work. Also, thanks for discussing dinosaurs. $15. Chris says, Thank you. Tie tab fall. Tie tab fall. Tie tab fall. <laughs> um, oh, I saw the Sonic Chronicles thing up. Future. Uh,. By the way, to address somebody from earlier in the stream, still waiting on that thousand dollars to play nothing but Euro Truck for the rest of the stream. Yeah, yeah I'll do that, especially <laughs> right now. Thanks for uh, showing Nuclear Throne for a bit. By the way, guys. No, no problem. problem. That game's super. That game's fun. I like that game. Yeah, thanks for uh, thank you. Thanks for giving it to us. It's yeah, no problem. Uh, Paul, do you have an opinion of uh, Donkey Konga? I fucking love Donkey Konga. Right? <laughs> last year, last year I pitched so hard for Donkey Konga, and you guys, Kyle and Keith, seemed like super miserable about it until we set it up, and then you were like, oh, this is so much fun. I can say Kyle was definitely into it from the start. You were? Was I, it you know, was I, miserable I, about I'm it? Donkey Konga... Uh, Kyle never shuts up about Donkey yeah, Konga. I'm, like, I love Donkey like, Konga. I'm a Donkey it's Konga a good game. evangelist. I would love Donkey Konga if the songs were better. I feel like I don't like any of the songs. But that's also kind of what's great about it, though. Is it? Uh-huh. There's so many rhythm games that have fun, good songs, and Donkey Konga kind of doesn't. 
Uh, now that someone has reminded me that Crypto the Necrodancer exists again, I, I I just basically like had a moment. Where I was like, that's what I should have been playing all month. Any, uh, yeah, anyway, that game's really good. Over, yeah. Um, uh, yeah, I have to relocate some things and go to the bathroom, and then you guys can figure out what the seat thing is. And I'm gonna put this busted cup away. That sounds like a plan. And... Someone should take these chips away from me because I'm just gonna keep eating them. I'm gonna get greasy stuff all over the bongos. Salt and vinegar chips. I think I have the clip over here. I do have the clip. Here you go. Clip, clip. Clip pass. I don't want to get my hands salty greasy either. <laughs> Ow. Um, people are remembering the desynchronization that happened last no, it's time. Fine, it's fine. You okay. Got it? fine. Hey, good morning, Dvac. Don't worry about the desync. Hey, Dvac. Dvac, you're, you're just in time. Text. Orange. It's just yeah. in time for the main event. Dvac, you're just in time for Donkey Konga. Hmm. Where'd my remote go? Salt and vinegar for life. Cannot think of a name. You're my best friend now. That's the best kind. Paul, what's your favorite kind of chip? Hmm. Um, I like sea salt and vinegar. Those sea salt good. and vinegar? Yeah, yeah. that's yeah. what's up. Have you ever had Cape Cod potato chips? I have not. There, I actually have heard of some people that have been able to get them in the UK. I don't know if they would extend <laughs> as far over as to where you are. Um, mm -hmm. But there is a tiny little factory located here on Cape Cod where we live. And they make kettle cooked potato chips in some very unique flavors, and mm -hmm. they're available actually pretty much everywhere in the United States. Anywhere, I don't think we've gone anywhere where I've not been able to find somewhere some flavoring. Um, I should probably try to get those when I'm. They're back really in the good. They have some really good flavors. They have a, a salt and cracked pepper, sea salt and cracked pepper chip that's really good. Kyle, you liked mm -hmm. the jalapeno cheddar chips, right? Yep. Yep, and. Um, so the only thing that I have come up against a moral dilemma with these chips, which just sounds so bizarre, but I work at a personal injury firm and we handle workers' compensation and I'm the workers' mm -hmm. compensation paralegal. So I am the person that handles all of the cases that come in on workers' comp. And we have an astounding number of cases from from this company. And so throughout that process, I have learned so much about their everything behind the scenes and it has just every time I see a bag, I'm like, oh, those are so good. And then I'm like, but do I really want to support them? <laughs> yeah, it's but That's I tough. they're so freaking good. Um, yeah, the, someone said they saw the crab flavored. Yeah, they have like a new a new one. That's I don't remember what kind of it tastes like the seasoning that they used to cook them. Um, good. Yeah. And uh, Lay's if anybody. Oh, I should find that and drop it in. There's a, a new commercial that just came out for Lay's potato chips for their new flavor lobster roll, and they actually filmed it downtown in the town where we live, um, because our town is named Sandwich. So What? <laughs> yeah, we live in the town of Sandwich. Like what you eat. There's one in Illinois, and there's one in Britain somewhere. Um, but ours is the coolest. Now I feel like I definitely have to find that commercial and put it in the chat. Hmm. I think the weirdest chips that I've had were like vanilla flavored. That sounds really is, weird. It was really weird because when you eat them, it's like, oh, this tastes like a cookie. And then the salty part hits and it's like, no, this is chips. And it's like, yeah. It's such a bizarre thing. All right, so where am I sitting? Uh, I haven't moved. Um, would you mind, Keith, putting these things somewhere where they will not get damaged? No. Cool. Even in this office, it's totally fine. I'll just put them on the stairs. And then, um... Seems like a safe place where no one walks. Late. I gotta, I gotta move over. There's some weird buzzing. Okay, it's gone. This thing okay. keeps... Are you just asking me to move closer to the middle, or are you asking me to move closer to the edge? To the middle. To the middle. Alright, so it's gonna be me and Keith Kyle. I'm gonna move this no, over here. Oh, okay. It's just for camera purposes. Uh, these ones, do you want them somewhere, Kyle? I just don't want them to get lost in the couch or broken. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna probably have to put the laptop down, right? Uh. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's not someone on Skype. 
Kyle, we have a funny story about Kyle and chips from when we were at the grocery store recently. We were trying to purchase, make purchases on a strict budget, and then um, we went for a, a second trip to the grocery store where we had a little bit more money, and we got basically just a bunch of stuff that we wanted. Um, and so I looked over and saw that Kyle had put into the uh, cart a bag of chocolate chips. Is it the chocolate ones from Lay's? Chocolate-covered chips. Co- chocolate-covered chips. And so I pretty much did one of those traditional mom, like, we're not getting those. Put those back. <laughs> and then, like, two aisles later, we were walking by some weird stand of the product of some kind. <laughs> and he stopped, and he was like, oh, look, someone else got, <laughs> got in trouble for doing exactly what I did because there was just a random bag of chocolate-covered chips sitting in that <laughs> container. <laughs> like, someone got caught mid-grocery shop and was forced to put them away. <laughs> Oh, I'm gonna have to take this off my lap. Yeah, our yeah I was just saying the same thing. Um, so, dear chat, we love you, but we probably won't be able to see you. Namco! I wanna say this. I wanna say this as a, as, as a man, as a friend, and as a musician. I'm terrible at Donkey Konga and many rhythm games. I'm no good at them. I was I was pretty I was very good at Guitar Hero for like a minute. Cannot do it. Cannot handle rhythm games. You were very good at Guitar Hero. I was I would beat the game on expert. All right. Okay. All right. Yeah. Sorry. That's fair. I apologize. Um, Before we start, uh, you got a donation from CB Reed Eleven saying, "Watching you from Kingston, Tennessee. I love watching you play classic games. Keep up the good work." All right. I think we're probably gonna crank up the. Do we do the did we do the the clap test already? Paul, if you don't feel like sitting around listening to us play Donkey Konga and not talk in the chat or not talk in Skype while we play, just let uh, us know. I don't know. Like, do, like, do you guys want me around for Donkey Konga or? Um, Paul wants to know if we want him around for Donkey Konga. Uh, yeah, sure, whatever. It's totally up to you. <laughs> I'm trying to. Okay. I'll stick around for a bit. I can look at the chat. So it's mine. <laughs> Oh yeah, I mean, if if you want to check out the chat, That's I mean, me. by all means, yeah. we're sure. we're good for that. Because I was just about to say, like, mm, probably not gonna be able to see my laptop anywhere. I of course have the broken bongo, so we should mark that as broken and get rid of it. Yeah. Gonna have to replace it for all that four-player Donkey Kongo we play. Yeah, we're not gonna be four-player Donkey Kong going with a broken bongo, are we? Yeah. Uh, Dvac says chocolate bars with potato chips in them for crunch are pretty good. There's actually a local person down here who makes those and various flavors, and they're so GD good. But they 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 make they make chocolate bars that have like rice crisps or nuts in them. Chips are way better. Crunch. Chips are way better. Is it two of them? This one didn't work either. What? Wait, the other one might have worked. You gotta, you gotta stop for a second. First time Keith's ever been randomly pressing buttons on a menu and made it a problem for somebody. <laughs> Listen, if you put a drum in front of me, I'm gonna tap on it. That's just me. It worked. I saw it work. Try. Yeah, it's working. I can hear it. It might just be mine. It's you know, it's selective. That's Keith's. They both don't work. You know, it's okay. It's not a big deal. I'm pretty sure we can find some inexpensive Donkey Konga bongos. Oh, Dvac, uh, Dvac made a donation and says, Congratulations on making it through another marathon. I wish you the best in future expansions of the Run Button brand. Thank you, Very Dvac. nice. Thank you. Guys, Run Button chat, I need you to help me convince these guys to legitimately let me be their business manager and grow this shit as a business now that I'm going to be working from home. <laughs> <laughs> We're all ready. We have shirts and everything. We'll split it by one third. I'll take a third. Nicole will take a third. Keith will take a third. <laughs> Done. Well, no. This I feel like if I, I bet. I feel like I want to like make you guys a bet and be like, if I can find a way to increase your income monthly by X amount, then I get all of that <laughs> every month. <laughs> this sounds just like a bad bet. That sounds that's, like we that lose. sounds like a great bet. Well, that means that you guys don't lose any of your current Patreon income. No, but and you're we've giving never more lost. exposure to your brand. Uh, but the exposure to our brand doesn't help if you're getting the money as a result of the exposure to the brand. And then by extension, some of that touches Kyle's gentle head. All right. 
So, uh, I turn up the game a bunch, so we're probably hard to hear, but it'll, you know, we're playing a music game. Yeah. Yeehaw. What is run button con? Uh, somebody says you need more shirts that actually say run button. I would agree with that. A lot, almost yeah. all of them say run button on the back. They say them on the back. On the button, back. Yeah. On, yeah, this is runbutton.com on the back of the shirt. Um, so once we have our new oh, logo, we, we will donation. have a logo t shirt. Um, that reminds me, I, uh,. I made a sketch for that for that grape t-shirt, so I'll send that oh, to Oh, man, you. yeah. <laughs> That's cool. Thank you. Uh, Kavanaugh made a donation and says, y'all are my favorite brand. Thanks, Kavanaugh. You're my favorite brand. You're my favorite brand. Actually, no. My favorite brand is Fig Newton. My, actually, my favorite brand is Fruit of Grape. And my second favorite <laughs> brand is, is Fruit of Grape, and then my third favorite brand is Kavanaugh. All right, here we go. Oh, uh, Gals Got Moxie donated and says, Thanks for the many hours of enjoyment. Each new video is a guaranteed fun time. Keep up the good work. Oh, and donated $50. Wow. Thank yeah. you. And um, Kavanaugh donated $5, and DVAC donated $25. So. You guys are great. You guys Thank are you awesome. guys very much. I shake it back. You're all my favorite brand tied with Fig Newtons. Is, you want to do a jam sesh? I, uh, yeah, jam sesh. Oh, can we do that? Can we do that classical song? Uh, which one? That one's oh. fun. Yeah, it's the Hungarian dance march in G first. minor. Not first. Oh. Okay, we gotta. I'm gonna whip it. We gotta. What the hell? What's wrong? My phone didn't charge any of this entire time, even though it started charging. How about campfire medley? We can start with that, I guess. If we're gonna be. Look at how many difficulties it is. Do I have? The controller facing the logo facing me or facing out? What the fuck? Oh, do you have a lightning cable down here? This cable's not working at all anymore. Which means that my phone's been dead this entire time. There aren't any in that drawer. Other micros that you can try with the adapter. I think it's the adapter that's not working. You don't have any lightning cables down here? Alright, well, I'm gonna have to go get one. Oh, what happened? Oh, I think I might have just went on the road again. Oh, just can't no. wait to get on the road again. I accidentally started because I was trying to go back, and it's just oh. me. It's me and the CPU. No, that's wrong with press. I don't know how this game is. As you can see, I missed every single one of those. That's a fun intro, though. There's like a significant amount of lag on when you hit it and when it registers. And I don't know, like, when it wants me to hit the note. There, there might just be some lag on the TV. Can okay, we have the button facing you or facing out? Facing. Okay. It wasn't working at all. Do you want to plug it into my computer? No, you can plug it into my computer, but it's the, the only part of the battery we have is stopped working. I thought that you used to it doesn't it usually give you a little light and inside the battery? If it's yeah. if it's super out of battery, it'll just do that for a little bit, I think.
Am I player three? Um, I'm player two. Right? Yes. Yes. Can you, uh, can you turn my headphones around a bit, please? Who's that? That is from the coffee when it, I didn't realize it was filling, and I haven't had anything to wipe it up with. Um, take a little, take some drops of coffee. Well, I forgot about it because we were doing other stuff. See, here's the thing: it's impossible to clap with the beat because there's so much lag. Like I'm gonna clap with the beat. It's gonna. It's not doing really anything. I'm just gonna let it try and try and do something. When you guys are, I'm just waiting for you. I, I said yes. You gotta press your ready button. Okay. Sorry. Oh wait, which buttons are which? Yellow is left. makes it basically impossible. I don't know if it's the display lag. I think it's the like, delay with the audio and the these. headphones. No. Well, I know that I'm. my hard time is mainly because I 
can't get the feedback on the claps, so it throws off my rhythm anyways. The the thing that I think is the problem is that these have always had lag, because this no. is the same lag that I felt the last time that we played, and the what's the visuals is syncing up with the audio. What's not syncing up is the controller. Do you guys just want to play the two of you? Because it, my controller's broken anyways, so... Is Paul still uh, here? Is my head I'm here. Oh, okay. Hi, I was like, I'm <laughs> it's been very quiet. I'm, I'm just enjoying this concert. Unfortunately, Donkey Kong, it seems like a CRT only type deal. Yeah, it's like a lot of rhythm games are like that. Yeah. Like old rhythm games and stuff, so. You just let me play DDR. That's what you should do. Why don't I mean, you is, your, right ahead. is your TV on game mode? That might help, but. Kyle is really obsessive about what mode our television is in at any it's given point in time. It doesn't have a, t- a game mode. Yeah. Okay. Huh. Plus, you can always swap it out for the living room TV. Plus, it's running. It's running through a video processor, so there's added display. Right. Right. Um. Do you guys want to do this round without me? You want to do whip it? You want to do the the impression that I get? Yeah. Surprisingly difficult. Once you stop paying Bye. attention to the music at all, here's the, here's Kyle's biggest secret: is that Kyle only listens to ska music. Kyle only <laughs> listens to third music. wave ska. It's, it's just it's nothing but uh, boss tones and save Ferris all day long. Mm-hmm. Uh, chat was wondering if there's calibration for this game. This game, there there really isn't. Yeah, um, I, I can check, but this was like way before that. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yeah it's like pre HD era, so there's probably yeah. no calibration. Um, also, uh, Kyle, you're on the uh, soft side of the microphone. No, I'm on the good side. Oh, then maybe your microphone is just a little quiet. Yeah, probably. I can bump you up a little bit more. Yes, please. But you're bumped up. Consider yourself bumped. Thank you. You're welcome. We good? Here's the other thing about the bongos is that like they don't sound good with the music. <laughs> like the actual- No, no, they don't, yeah. Like everything about this game is like a slight miss. As I can I can ignore the music and do well. Ugh, it's the worst. Yeah. It's like it's just off enough to be just like completely out like Listening to the music actually hurts you, and then, like, what are yeah. you even doing if you're ignoring the music in a rhythm game? You're just playing a reaction game. Yeah, it's so weird. You gotta, you gotta do it like half a beat before the actual thing. This is so fucking weird.
we killed it. Yeah, you did. We're going on tour. <laughs> uh, you have a new Ask FM that says, is Keith better at violin or fiddle? Those are the same thing. <laughs> that so might... Literally the same instrument. Uh, so fiddle. No, I already answered it. Sorry. That's fine. They heard. Well, but uh, it, the cool thing is that this will be um, on your rope, uh, your profile. So if you attach your Ask FM to your Run Button Twitter, yeah, people can ask you stuff. What do we want to do? Let's do a way harder song. We're no, we're definitely not playing more of this. We're gonna do the hardest song in the whole Fortunately, it does not work. Challenge mode, a duet challenge mode. Chimp. Here, we're gonna do this. No, just me. All right. I won't even let me in it. I won't even let me in it. As someone, Kyle, with impeccable rhythm, that was offensive. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Copacetic says, fell asleep with the stream on, woke up to this racket. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. Although I don't know what time zone you're in, but it might be time to wake up anyways. So, Kyle, what are you? What do you want to play? Uh, from me or from the chat? I've wanted to play it for a while. Here you go. Take your thing. So, just because that way I'm not, they don't think that I'm not passing on to you, because neither of you guys can see the chat right now. So, Chess Neckbeard points out that fiddle is a bluegrass violin. Uh, fiddle is bluegrass, violin is classical, and they're played differently. I will say this, instead of what you said, it's actually fiddle is a word used colloquially for all genres of music across the word world for violins. The common misconception being that fiddle is a separate genre of violin is actually any, any violinist will just sometimes call their violin a fiddle. Bum, 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 bum. is super great. I agree. You know what? Doggy Congress should have some Bela Flexons in it. Can we? Can I do this as like an an intermission, and you guys can decide how you guys want to end the the stream? Yeah. Well, it's you only have an hour and a half left. <laughs> what? You have an hour and a half left. So it looks like I'm gonna be allowed to play DDR on a controller on the PS2 for a few minutes, and you guys can navigate how you want to end your stream. Is that gonna work with the latency? Oh, it works. <laughs> I've, yeah. I I tested it yesterday. Well, because we this office is a the office that we're playing is a brand new expansion to our home because mm -hmm. uh, we have the baby due in May and we don't have enough room for the baby. So the office was the room that got sacrificed. So I worked really really hard all summer at a waitressing job and I saved a lot of money. And my stepdad is a contractor, so he helped us and we built this room in our basement that is finally finished. And so then we were moving everything into the basement this week so that the office would be ready for the marathon. And so when we set up, we have like a cool entertainment center and I helped Kyle organize it so that all the systems that he wanted would be plugged in and ready to go at any point in time. He just has to power them on and then go to the right input. Um, and there's, so there's 11 systems, I think, that are basically just always at the ready. And then we have two situ systems that can be swapped out for another one that use the same type of power cord or AV solution. And they're already set up to go through the FrameMeister, which is the recording product thing that they use. And we also have a switcher and all that. So at any given time, he can just turn on the, turn on a stream and, and turn on a system and turn it on. Um. So pretty cool nice. there's still some fiddle violin chat in the in the uh, in the chat i just want to read the first paragraph of the fiddle entry for for on wikipedia for the fiddle 
Fiddle is another name for the bowed instrument, more often called a violin. It is also a colloquial term for the instrument used by players in all genres, including classical music, fiddle playing, or fiddling, which could refer to various styles of music. Discussion over. Done. All right. Hey, this stream might crash. Hope it doesn't. <laughs> It, I now hear DDR music, so. Okay, so I'm going to put my laptop down so that I can play this awesome game. I would be fine with trying songs that people in the chat want me to try, if that's a thing that would be helpful. DDR Max. Are you really good at DDR, Nicole? I might be. <laughs> Nicole's very good at DDR. Um, I've never seen it. I've just heard about it a bunch. It's occurring to me that now that I don't have a laptop on my lap, it might be easy to see the problem with the Sonic pajamas. So as a heads up, so that nobody makes comments about it later, um, the Sonic pajamas did not dry very well in the dryer and developed some seam rippage and some in a, in unfortunate places. <laughs> so I have a pair of, of shorts on underneath the Sonic pajamas as a result of that. So this way we don't have people calling out in the chat like, hey, there's a big hole in your pajamas. Like, yes, <laughs> this is a thing that I'm aware of. <laughs> Kyle, do you want my laptop so you can be in the chat? No. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, could you either turn up game volume or turn up my headphones a little bit? Pretty test, please? test, test, test. Why can I not exist? I'm pretty loud, actually. Yeah, uh, Keith, can you turn up Nicole's headphones? Pretty please. You are... Do, um... Go on. What's that? Silent Hill? Yeah. Uh, Silent Hill. What? That's what we're doing. All right, well, let me what? do this one to get used to the video lag. Yeah, um, Keith, could you turn up my headphones just a little bit? The video lag has this. Good. Good. Perfect. The video lag Perfect. Be... Yeah. Okay. I'm not going to be able to... If you talk to me, I won't be able to answer you. The video lag should be exactly the same as it was the last time you played. No, it's not. It should be. No, it's not. It is. Okay. Maybe this controller's not working then because it's not even acknowledging buttons that I'm pushing. You know what it is? It's the audio lag. Um, That's exactly what it is. It's just audio lag. Why don't you just take off your headphones off? That's what I'm going to do. Hold on. I can't pause it. <laughs> there we go. Maybe that was our problem with that the audio I told you, I was like, I think it's the yeah. sound. Oh, no. Uh, I will say that with Donkey Konga, the lag was significant. The lag was like, like, it was. The lag yeah, on was, this was pretty significant was with the sound. But like, it was like a quarter of a second even with Donkey Konga. We have video on somewhere on like my phone or something of Nicole basically doing these heavy level songs like at an arcade on a for real DDR. Yeah, I'm actually not That's terrible at it. Crazy. I'm I'm super out of shape though. Not terrible. <laughs> well, I'm uh, compared to when I used to play a lot, I'm pretty That's terrible. Silent Hill. Okay, Silent can I do Hill. one more song that I'm used to just because I played half that song on a really crazy lag? Is one of the ones that you're used to Take Me Away by Four Strings? No. Okay. Okay, this is, so there's one more song in this game, so I'll do Silent Hill next. I just want to make sure that I'm not going to F it up just because I'm not used to it. <laughs> uh, Dvac says that Jordan says, if you like DDR with a controller, try Hatsune Miku Project Diva F. Ooh. I actually do want to try that game because it looks super fun. It's pretty good, apparently. I want to play all the Hatsune Miku games. Cause she's awesome. You, move, you guys are supposed to be talking. You look mesmerized. Yeah, I am mesmerized. <laughs> I'm just tired. Everyone is mesmerized. Um, we don't need to provide commentary. Let's 
Scrogda says, I know a guy who got way into DDR on the end of high school and he must have lost at least 100 pounds. Yeah. That's nuts. It's That's really lot. good exercise. That's way more than we fit. Yeah. Um, someone in the chat says, could never let's could never let's blaze and play DDR with a controller. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, we're not, this isn't the last half hour, this is the last 90 minutes, but also, I would go longer if you guys wanted to go longer, just saying. At some I'm point, like, I'm going to have to go get Lucas. <sighs> okay, so you want me to play Silent Hill? That's close to that. I mean, it's a. It's not it's, the same Silent Hill, I mean, right? we don't know that. We don't know that. But I don't know not. what it is at all. I, I, never bet it's, it. I bet it's some kind of like house remix of like the Silent Hill theme or something. That sounds be. pretty amazing. It could be anything. Because, <laughs> like, there's a bunch of garbage in here like that. Yeah, there's a lot of bad songs. Uh, Silent Hill? It's oh, in blue, I think. There's one called Twilight Zone, though. That is the actual Twilight Zone song. Re oh, well, oh, there wait, you go. That. Perfect example. Let's That's that a really instead. hard song. That's what you want? Yeah. No, do Silent Hill. Wait, no, fuck Silent Hill. Let's do Twilight Zone. I mean, I can do this one. You have to do both. Okay. Wait, that's not the Twilight yeah, Zone. Yeah, that's more like the Mortal Kombat. It's a song. okay. Yeah, okay. That's fine. Uh, Silent Hill. It's blue. blue. <laughs> <laughs> Do it anyway. Really? Yeah, Thomas right. Howard's my I'm gonna, favorite. I'm gonna speed it up a little bit because it seems like Howard it's gonna be. Thomas Howard is my favorite Howard Blood brother. Just Clint a little. Clint and Ron Howard be damned. What's flat? What's? Dark? It just has to do with the way that the um. The, the steps show up. up. I used to play with a version like when I wanted to challenge myself on songs that were harder. There's a version where when the steps get to the top, they disappear. Never played this before, guys. No judging. I want to play this. Go ahead. We can. Oh, we can do different difficulties, right? Yeah. Why aren't we playing two player? We can play two player. This is a fucking slow jam. Yeah, it is. That's why I sped it up. <laughs> it's a Christmas song? Is it? I don't know. You tell me. I don't know. I don't know anything about this. It's saying Christmas is here repeatedly. Wait, sorry. Did I say I don't know anything about this? I mean, Thomas Howard is my favorite Howard brother. Ron and Clint Howard be damned. Our whole new games thing really fell apart in the second half, I feel like. Name a really good new game that's fun to play. That everyone in your chat wouldn't have hated you for. Dark uh, Souls 2. Earth Defense Force. Earth Defense there, Force. There, you already played Mac. that. Mac. You already played that, twice. Smash Brothers. You already played that? Mario Kart 8. You already played that? We could play more. This sounds like a really weird song. This sounds really short. It's a new well, record. yeah. I mean, it's an arcade game, so the oh, idea. Oh man, you got a new record. Quarter, put quarters in. Oh, people are asking if I was wearing a Totoro costume. If you're what? Mm -hmm. <laughs> there you go. Now I am more Sonic. This this round is over. Do you want to start a uh, uh, yes uh, versus round? You know why cool. Nicole is so fast with the DDR? Because I'm Sonic. The Sonic. Oh no. I don't know. I feel like I'm. <laughs> so it's just. They're both the same on both sides, right? Yeah. No, the left um, side is reversed. Matt Mitchell was asking if we played Virtual Highlight. We did. We did. We played. Briefly. Virtual... We could go back to it. So the we problem, didn't, we didn't the problem play it. was that Kyle and I were both. I was at my lowest <gasps> point, definitely. Mario Party. And Kyle was no, near. No, we can't. We gotta save it. We're we almost there. Oh. We got through six of the remaining. Uh, four, no, eight. Kyle? We... Standard. we got the, right, like, song? six or seven of the remaining 16 levels of Yoshi's Island, so we're almost done. What song? Um, oh, let's play... Oh, no, never mind. Take Me Away. Yeah. This one? Yeah. No. Not into it. No? I like 
less into this, actually, though. <laughs> Don't listen to Keith. Yes. Here we go. Found it. This is a really good song. I don't know, Kyle, what you gonna play? Oh, wait, Kind Lady was good. Let's do that. Yep, this is the best one. This one? Yep, yeah, sure. Uh, okay. I'm going 1.5 speed. I'm like that. You gotta, now you gotta hit, the, yeah. There you go. Oh, man, I don't know. Are you on the same difficulty? No. Okay, there it is. There, it, it was the same for a little bit. You know what? I'm going to say this was not as hard as I was expecting it to be. You know what's cool? Um, I just like that you can use both sides. Okay. Well, yeah, it would be impossible yeah. if you couldn't. Right. Well, you just have to use the... You just have to hold the controller weird. No, I don't um, think you can actually press both Moxie sides. Moxie says, did the stream die? I'm still seeing the stream. Ah. Guys, I don't want to speak too soon, but I think I might be a DDR controller prodigy. What difficulty are you on? Standard. Standard. I didn't do so bad. No, it's fine. All right, I'm gonna make dinner, guys. It so was like my thumb. Oh, we both got new records. Uh, Sign Rider wants to know if this is the game that has the Love and You remix. I don't think so. There was. Wait. Uh, Thanks for yep. uh, having me on, guys. I'm out. Good this actually could be interesting. I bet it. I bet it jumps up really fast. Because it's got a lot of voltage and stream. Okay. You can try it if you want. Do whatever you want. You want to try it? Yeah. Okay. I'm leaving mine on 1.5, but I forgot to check if you wanted yours on 1.5. Sorry. Yeah, I want one, mine on 1.5. That's how I roll, always. Oh, Paul's leaving. Bye, Bye Paul. I don't have headphones, oh, so I, I can't, can't hear you. Out. I'm sorry, Paul. I forgot all about it. <laughs> it's because we were playing Doggy Congas, and then the TV went on. Paul, Bye. Bye, Paul. You're pretty awesome. Thank you very much for yeah. your help. You move, move it. Kelsey said, "Can they not hear?" Well, there was a there was lag, and then we were testing out like you playing the music through the TV, and then there was horrible lag in my ears. So I took my headphones out and then went to the bathroom, came back that and forgot to put my headphones back in. Weird. Messed up at the end there. That was kind of lame. Wow. No me gusta. Uh, Paul says he's just going to make dinner and he'll be around on the chat. Okay. I really like this guy keeps on telling you guys you got new records. It's a fucking. Does uh, anybody in the chat have any additional song requests? Uh, jam and marmalade, obviously jam and marmalade. <laughs> No, uh -uh. <laughs> oh, breakdown, breakdown. You like breakdown? Yes, that's right. the one. Uh, I need to change. You, you don't want this to be a 1.5. Okay. 
I, I heard always 1.5. This whole time I kept, I kept thinking like, I know there's some song in here that's my jam, but I don't know what it is or how it goes. Breakdown's my jam <laughs> since <laughs> since yesterday or whatever. I don't think Butterfly is on this round, but we can look at it. I don't think it's on. This is a so. DDR Max 2. Oh, shit. What is this? Did no. you not look at the amount of steps on your difficulty? Did I heavy? What is this? Yeah, you did. No, I don't want to be heavy. I can't do this. Wait, let me try. Let me try. Give to me. Ugh. I can't. I know. That's, give it to me. Let me try it. I can carry you. He's saying he can't, but he's doing it. I mean, he's not doing it well, but he's still going. I am owed another breakdown, god damn it. Okay. Breakdown. I bet this is over in like eight seconds. No. No? No. They're all so short. How is this one the long one? It's coming up. The end or the breakdown? There's a bridge. Okay. She like knows these songs by heart. It's a good bridge. You got oh. that straight line perfect, Kyle. Thank you. Did I get switch how did I switch myself to heavy? Let me try, let me try. I must not have been paying attention. Stop it. Why well, why you do you stop? What you is stop oh, pressing you're, buttons? You're too far away, dude. Am what I? is your? I just don't understand your obsession with trying things that you have no hope of accomplishing. You had stopped pressing the buttons. It, it makes perfect sense. But you wouldn't have done any better, so why bother? Because I just wanted to experience it, Kyle. What's wrong with you? Stop no, I don't this. understand. It doesn't, make, it doesn't make any sense that you're confused by that. I'm trying to understand. You go, this is so weird, I can't do this. And then I'm like, oh, let me see how that's like. And you're like, why the fuck would you ever want an experience? Yeah, Mommy, I don't Daddy, get it. stop fighting. I don't get it. Uh, Havoc Pioneer said, is this DDR or, or Nicole Unleashed? <laughs> It just made me giggle. Oh, we get one more point, and then we can get we can unlock another item. Do you want to try breakdown again on standard this time? Yes, please. Okay. Kavada says, Keith, why do you hold on to your mortal hope? Abandon all and give up life. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. Listen, it's not Whoa, it's sorry. not that I wouldn't understand Keith wanting to try this game, but it's like Like obviously that's impossible, except for her. I've never tried it. I've never played DDR in my whole life. You haven't lived. It's a lot Keith. of fun. You haven't lived. I'm surprised how quickly like the way my brain thinks about my legs when I'm playing it normally, like mapped onto my thumbs. It was weird. The headphones are giving this a ch this song a charming reverb. <laughs> Uh, Kramer says this looks no easier. No, there's like a probably like a third less notes. Yeah, there's a lot less eighth notes It makes all the difference Um Epic of the World says, I like the crazy stuff happening in the background. Yeah, yeah the, the weirdo the frog. The stuff in the background is both super crazy and also par for the course for weird music <laughs> videos. Like, it's both the most nuts thing I've ever seen and oh, and 100% the normal. Yeah, it, Well, it's completely par for the course for DDR. Right. But all these all these effects are, like, very, are, like, standard effects. It's just adding a weird frog 
the the really weird stuff is when they occasionally pick a song that actually somehow had a music video like in Europe or something and it's like the most insane thing. Uh, like in like the house techno whatever remix of uh ooh, I got a new in record. the navy. I was actually someone was just asking you, if there are any want, Captain Jack I'll songs. I'll check it out. I'll check it out. I'll check out a song. What's he this? can switch to In the Navy is light, a Captain really. Jack song. I'm not going to switch like, to light. I can do fucking standard. What do you think I am? Somebody that can't do standard? something from Captain Jack, right? Because well, those had the videos. <laughs> um, the problem with Captain Jack songs is I think the only one that's on here is In the Navy. And that's a really hard song to start out at uh, because it's all gallops, which are really hard to learn. What when are you're gallops? Just, uh, it's eighth notes that are set as if you were skipping. Like if you were playing on the with your legs, it would look like you were skipping. It's like, uh, okay. do 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 Oh, that's, yeah. But okay. it's really hard exactly to just jump in that way. But it's still on light, though? Yeah, it's still gallops. I mean, are you going to play on light? standard i'm gonna play on Ooh. standard we're gonna play this this is a captain jack song yeah, there you go there we go dream, captain jack. Another, another captain i, jack I song. understand the concept of gallops like as a like i don't know what they're called because i don't know music words but yeah. like i know what those are and how to play them on instruments do you want to do a standard or on light standard you sure yeah okay i'm changing my speed to 1.5 you don't have to do that Keep um change just hit next do it don't Just be mad. Hit X a bunch until you get to the bottom. Okay. I love the sound effects for these buttons. It's just so visceral yeah, and yeah. nostalgic it's, for me. Here's the Kyle. Here's the thing that I don't mind losing at this level until I understand what I'm doing. I think "Blow My Whistle" is another song that has a fun video. So, like, I guess this ostensibly was a music video that someone like put on television somewhere and someone enjoyed it. Maybe. Ooh la la di la la la. Or maybe I'm just forgetting how insane the 90s were. Okay, all right. (laughs) Cranberm just says, what the fuck is this? Making me scream. Ooh, la, da, dee, la, da, da. You gotta dream a little dream. Oh! Did you just? I literally that? perfect that entire game. Mm. It's a new play. record. <laughs> Do you want to try another one on uh, light? No, I'm going to go standard. What All the right. fuck? What are you talking about? Like, it's well, like there's nothing wrong happened because I was on standard. Um, I mean, except that you got an E. Blow My Whistle might be a fun game, a fun song. I think that's in blue. You sure you don't want or it's to the whistle song. Down again? I just want to make sure that you guys know that because I got an E doesn't mean I'm unsafe. Like, it's fine. This is a fun one. Let's do this okay. one. This one has a lot of jumps. How are you are you good with the jumps? I don't know what that means. It means that you hit two buttons at the same time. Sure. Okay. Jump. Oops, I left my I left my speed up a little bit. Like this isn't I don't this doesn't This one has another funny video. I, I just I think rhythm games and DDR specifically are a game that you can't like fail at something too hard until you get it. Like you have to actually start small. Uh, Keith proved me wrong. Yeah, fuck off. You guys are the worst. Keith, we just want to see you succeed. I'm perfecting this song so far, by the way. Keith, uh, well, Keith is beating Nicole on standard. So. Pick up your no, I just hit, I just missed it. <laughs> that's just like that man's face. So like, that's why I thought you liked the video. God, like no. <laughs> Fuck you, '90s. Like these videos are truly the dark side of the decade I was born in. 
What's that? What? Vodka in the chat's gonna give you a shirt, Nicole. What? No. <sighs> he said, I'm just giving Nicole shirt and then like tried oh. to correct himself and he's just like, shirt. No shit. <laughs> <laughs> how did I type shirt twice? I just want to see everybody tell 90s me how kids right will I remember am, telling cool the 90s to fuck can off. Can I play breakdown again? You can play breakdown again. You again. <laughs> There you go. Again. All right. It's that we have to start Max a new combo, round. 101. We have to start another round. So does the chat Max have any other recommendations nice or boy. requests? He's a nice boy. For songs? I think we Do might have, have unlocked. other DDR games? I somehow all of them got lost. I don't know where they are. DDR but Max hey, 2 was like not the one. You know, when I pop this baby out, you're supposed to give me a special present. <laughs> <laughs> um, hold on. I want to see what we got new. Because if we unlock some new songs... Technically, I do have a PS2 that can play burned PS2 games. So, just saying. Dive. Put your faith in me. Mer. So. Think you better. We made the hedgehog says Keith is so cool and right. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> so cool and right. What's weird to me is the fact that this memory card is eight megabytes. Yeah, it's yep. fucked up. They're they're all eight megabytes. I mean, unless you had one of those, like, crazy third-party giant ones. I think I did. And Finn, thank you, We Make a Hedgehogs. All right, so a bunch of people are giving a recommendation for Dive. Do you want to play Breakdown first and then Dive? Okay. We'll do Breakdown, Dive, Breakdown. <laughs> I think Kyle's obsessed. This is my jam. It's Ready? definitely the best song. Oh, I forgot to take off my headphones, too. You know what? Um, all of my favorite songs are not in this version. I also used to know the code that would unlock all the songs, and I don't know what happened to that. I'm pretty sure one of... M Can't talk. I'm pretty sure <laughs> one of my favorite DDR songs was technically never in a DDR song and only in Clones, which was uh, Starion by some Korean group. I remember playing it in a DDR game, and I went to look up which one it was, and the only one I could find was a Korean version. It was like third mix Korea version or something. Um, third mixes still exist in the world. I used to drive up to Dartmouth because no, the, there was a fifth mix and a fourth mix there. Specifically the Korean version of third mix. You know what my favorite to this day still is? Um, there's a Disney mix machine. There's only one that exists in the world, and it's in the Space Mountain Arcade. And they have some really great songs in there. No, no, no! So the chat requested dive. Okay. Marvelous. The um, I like I'm so zoned in on the TV that like it's waving in my vision. Yeah. That sounds like a problem. It's the right way to do it. <laughs> like nope, nope, you got it. Yeah, no, that's exactly what we're supposed to do. I don't see dive anywhere. Oh, there it is. No, yeah, it's definitely there. Oh, yeah. I could get down for this. I don't think I've played this one either. Not a bad song. All right, ready?
Did you come with says Kyle touched the fuzzy? When what? You, when you were concentrating on the TV and yep, saying right? I, I touched fuzzy and got dizzy. That's right. I like that one. Wow. Not bad. It's, it's a, a new record. record. New record. I'm never going to get sick of that, ever. We're pretty evenly matched on our difficulties. I want to play Kyle in a standard <laughs> of a song that we haven't played before. A new quantity. AM3P is fun. Let's do Twilight Zone. Twilight Zone sounds like ass. Okay. Alright, fine, we'll do Twilight Zone. I don't care. No, I don't care. Okay, I I'm the one didn't get a chance to look at what the V's per minute were on this. I think it should be fine. Sorry. That was like a reflex. I just know this is a really hard song. I don't care. I'll take on anything. I don't give an F. Should have turned the speed up. That's why I like to look at the beats per minute before I choose. Have you found that call out to be sexist? Have you found what? Hi, Nicole. What? He always says you're not an ordinary fella. Do you find that sexist? Uh, a little bit? I don't know. No? Alright, it's fine. Just wondering. I mean, guys can listen to songs. It's just that in DDR, it says that like every two seconds. Oh, okay. It's, it's not part of the That's song, hard. it's part of the game when like, you're really oh, good. Oh, okay. Then sure. I thought that was part of the song. Another new record. Oh, oh my what God. happened? You missed like a ton in a row when you, right after you said I should turn the speed up. I should have turned the speed up. And then you missed like 10 in a row. Um, so what are we, what are we playing next? What game do you guys want to play? I want to face Kyle in a standard battle. Bring it, you son of a bitch. I'm going to go pee. I'm going to face you. Let's do, what's the one that I just did? Breakdown? I think it was breakdown. It wasn't breakdown. breakdown. We're not doing breakdown. We just do breakdown. We're not gonna do breakdown. Just come on and breakdown. I feel like the chat has had enough of breakdown. Holy the chat doesn't like breakdown? Well no, you've played it four times already. Uh three times. Actually it was only twice. No, it was three times. At least. Well, it was definitely at least three times. Technically the first one didn't count, I didn't get to play it. Alright. Versus. You gonna do what? Oh, okay. No, I'm not doing that again. That's a different version. What's up with that? I don't know. I think you better D. We should do AM3P. Why? I stopped falling in love. We should, I think, think you better D. 
I think that's... You can pick the song. I cannot pick. Oh, no, it's... You don't want to do this? You want to. Wait, you aren't heavy, dude. No, not. Yeah. How did that happen? Uh, I don't know. You fucked up. You gotta push select. Select? Yeah. Select, you could have changed it. Whatever, I can fucking do this. Now we're gonna back out. You gotta, you gotta restart it? We can't just, like, quit out? Afraid not. Once you're in, you're in. Why is the image frozen? On our TV, but not on... I don't know. Fucking games are weird, bro. Okay, fine. Glorp just says, two more hours. And someone's like, I thought it was just one more hour. Two more hours! <laughs> I will we'll see. I'm so tired. I'm fine. I'm not tired. I'm just like, I had all that coffee and I'm awake, but I'm like, Ugh. I'm like, Ugh. Uh, 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 you sure you don't want to do breakdown? Just wondering. I'm pot. We can do breakdown, breakdown after I smoke you. Bum, 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 bum. Watch right, right, standard, right. At press X. X. Yep. Standard. There you go, buddy. Oh, you know what? What? You can do, like, um, if you double tap up and down, it changes the difficulty. I just forgot that. Oh, uh, okay. I mean, I just remembered. I just forgot that. You had to just forgotten it. Is this, is this what it... You picked, um... You picked... I don't remember. Fuck the whistle song, God. Ooh, that one sounds good. Yeah, that one did sound good. This is it. This is the game. All right. It's the jam. Mm-hmm. I'm going to feel so bad for you. It'll be, I'll it's be gonna fine. It's going to be sad. It's going to be so sad. I'm going to fucking smoke you. I don't know. Oh, we forgot. We already did this one, huh? No, we, you didn't already do this one. It's so hard. Is it bad that I knew what it was? Yeah. You're beyond that at this yeah, point. Yeah, that's true. I'm beyond that. <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. It's okay. This part got weird. Oh, yeah, this is a really hard song. oh no! <laughs> I really, I really fucking it's, fell apart. Yeah, you don't need to be embarrassed. No, I'm not embarrassed. I just fell apart. Yeah, no, that's it's good that you're not embarrassed. You don't need to be. So deep is very good, but very hard. All right, rematch. Oh, not same on this song. One. Did you do AM3P? That one's good. We could do AM3P. I also like Superstar, but that's the one that we started with. Second stage. Second stage. Yeah, all Get right, the cool. Fuck Second stage. Ready. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad so this ready. worked out because I really wanted to play this game and I thought you guys would be like, okay, are you done yet? And now here we are. I'm very competitive. Even when I lose, I don't care. I just want to play a game and win or lose. This one is harder than the last one immediately. Mm -mm. I haven't gotten the uh, these these ones that look like they're next to each other are not next to each other. Oh, they're, eighth note? You've never seen those before? I've seen them. I just like ha am not comfortable enough with the. It's uh. 
The uh, arrows are colored differently depending on what like note they are, yeah. basically. So if they're different color, then they're not a like a double, basically. I would be more comfortable if it was moving twice as fast and they were twice as far apart. You can make that happen. That's why oh. a lot of people speed up their song. Okay. Yeah, instead of pushing X or whatever to select the song, you push select and it gives you special options and that's one of them. Let's try it. Let's do that. I want to see if that helps me. With this one or with a different one? With any one. Oh, okay. It's a new What's the... Um, I want to do that too, so we both do it. Because it's... Because like I really... Don't hit enter yet. So okay. your the BPMs is 130. You always want to aim for like a 180, 190. That's optimal. Huh. How about breakdown? No. <laughs> Since it's our last one, it's our last one. We could do breakdown. What do I press to do? The Heaven thing? is good. Oh, uh, when you're when you're when you've chosen a song and you hit select, you just whoa. Oop. Sorry, my select? bad. That hits select. Yeah. Hit select. No, no, no. Yeah. Sorry, meant When you've chosen a song, you hit X to select, but you hold it after uh, you. So that takes you to the options menu. I did. Ho- I did do it and it didn't work. Um. Why is it saving? I don't know. You did something. All right. I don't know. Game mode. Did you turn it over? No. Do you push square instead of X? No, I pressed X. Out, which is X. I pressed X and then select. No, you I don't. Held X you don't, pre- don't touch select at all. Oh. Why did you both tell me to hit select first? You said S2 first? selects. I, sa- I said push select. I was wrong. I don't know anything about DDR. Don't listen to me. Heaven is also pretty good. Hmm? The song Heaven. Someone, uh, Jesus Ball says something is pretty good. Cool. When was the last time Break you took the stream down? Breakdown. Oh, I don't know, whatever. People are saying it's freezing a lot. So okay, the stream will go down momentarily for a while, a little bit, for a second. Mm-hmm. 